Yo guys, what is up? I'm P Radar here, and I'm doing a little commentary for you guys today on a doubles gameplay that me and Promebot got. It's on the map of Bootleg, and it's a Radar doubles, which I know many of you have been requesting, especially Canadian, have been wanting me to do a Radar gameplay for some time, they said they really enjoy it, so I'm going to try to get some more out there. But I haven't really been playing Radar too much anymore, specifically because of that everybody does the same thing in this game and I'm not a big fan for radar in this game anymore I just got a little tired of it it's just stun stun rush do the same strat every time but um <clears throat> I posted two radar or non radar listen-ins for you guys uh, first one got some pretty good feedback on it second one got some good feedback on it and I thank you guys for that but um, there's two things that I want to talk to you guys about today. One is about me and what happened. It's not bad. But um, it's not bad at all, actually. And the other is something I want you guys to do. It would be very, very kind. And it would just help out someone a lot. But the first thing is, is I'm really happy because finally I got a wired connection. I've always been playing wireless and my connection has been shit. But now it's got an Ethernet cord in the back of my Xbox, and my connection is beautiful. I can host and not lose a gunfight. Really, really happy about that. But the gay thing was that we had to find a 70 foot, 70 foot Ethernet cord to reach to my Xbox because my router is five or six rooms away. So we had to find an Ethernet cord all long enough to go there, and. So that was kind of a hassle. We ended up spending around over 80 bucks. The Ethernet cord was like 39. The we had to buy this little like adapter thing. I don't even know what it was for, but they recommended it. So we got that, and that was like 20 bucks. But we spent a shitload of money. And uh, but I mean, it's I got a wired connection now. <laughs> That's all I care about. It's it was awesome. And also I got a wired controller, and I've been playing with a wireless controller, but. Uh, I got a black wired controller. I love it. Feels so good. I'm thinking about ordering a scuff, to be honest. Uh, Prone Blocked is going to be getting a scuff pretty soon, and he's next time I see him, he's going to let me like look at it and stuff. I hope, and that, I think that'll be really cool because scuffs look really sexy as a controller. Like they've got the little bumpers on the back where you can play. You can play on default and tactical at the same time, so like you can still drop shot and you can panic knife and all that shit. But, um, that's not the main topic that I wanted you guys to talk about, or talk to you guys about. The main topic is about Primary Grenade. You guys all know who he is, I'm pretty sure. Uh, recently he was about to get, uh, partnered, and he woke up, I guess, and his YouTube has been shut down for some odd reason. He had over, like, 1,100, 1,200 subs. And so now he's got to start from scratch, which is going to be really hard for him. Uh, he said he wasn't too upset about it, but I mean, I would be. 1,200 subs is a lot of subs for somebody who's not like in Machinima or some shit. But he worked hard to get those subs, and he's had to start a new channel and work his way back up. And I'm going to put his link in the description. He's, I think he's got over 100 subs to maybe 150 subs already. I mean, that's pretty good for couple days a week I mean I don't even have a hundred subs and he's already got a hundred but I mean it's because he had 1200 and he has really loyal subs I guess and they just sub right back to him but please go sub to him get his channel back up there and that would help a lot but um the like the little bitty thing that I wanted to talk to you guys about is like my f plans on what I'm gonna do about GB and stuff I'm not pro I'm not going to be playing Radar anymore. I mean, if you guys want me to get gameplays, I'll get a couple gameplays and dubs and stuff. But I'm not going to be playing Radar Team anymore in this game. It's just, it got boring to me. But Black Ops 2, you can believe that I'm going to go hard as shit. And I, I can't wait for Black Ops 2. I hope it's, I don't want it to be exactly like Black Ops where you can shoot through everything. But if it's similar to Black Ops, I'll love the game. It, Black Ops was my best radar game and I loved it, but I'm really, really looking forward to playing radar in that game and really looking forward to seeing all the people start out as new radar players in that game. And I'm going to nerd out on that game for radar and go hand ski. And if you guys hear my mic bug out, I'm sorry. It's my turtle beaches or pieces of shit. 
I think I told you guys I'm saving up for Astros, and this mic is broke. So if you hear little popping noises, it's my mic. Um, it's getting pretty close to the end of the gameplay, I guess you could say. These kids weren't the best, to be honest. They were like 2-0, and but I, they didn't play Radar. And I don't like canceling the people that accept Radar, because it's pretty much your fault if you don't play Radar and your retarded ass accepts it. But there you go. You guys see we beat him 4-1. Chrome block carries the hell out of me like usual. Not. But um, beat him 4-1. That's the end of the gameplay. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. And don't forget about Primary Grenade. Thanks, guys. Peace out.